Patty Donham from Wizard Attachments Company and I want to show you the No Hands Ribbon Wizard. This ribbon wizard applies multiple layers of ribbon, lace, and trim in just one easy step with no hands. Now let me show you what you get in the kit. Get one snap-on foot, two guides, the edge stitch guide, and the center stitch guide, and of course you receive an instruction booklet. Now let me show you just how easy it is to use the No Hands Ribbon Wizard. First of all you want to put your presser foot onto your machine and you just slip it under and pop it in just like usual. That's all there is to that. Of course I've threaded my machine already so I'm ready to go. Now all I have to do is add my guide and I've already threaded several ribbons in here. Look how wonderful this is. I've threaded four ribbons in here, but of course you could even do more. There's still a space for a small one at the top and then two or three more in the middle. And then I even have room for one more on the bottom. Now what I like to do is take my ribbon wizard with me when I shop for ribbon and that way I know exactly what I can use in my projects. Now the next thing to do is go ahead and slip it onto the toe of the presser foot. I'm going to slip my ribbon in and then just slip it right over the toe and press it down. That's all there is to that. Now it's, I'm ready to put my fabric into the machine. I've got lots here so it's going to take me a second to push it in here just like this. And then I'm going to put this over to the edge and I'm ready to sew. Now I've set my machine for a slight zigzag. And there you see, it's absolutely no hands. Now, wasn't that easy? I want to show you how to use the center stitch guide now. Now all I have to do is take this one off of the presser foot and then I'm ready to place the other one on. Oh, I love how that turned out though. Let's look at that a little bit. Wouldn't that be great on the edge of a little girl's dress or even the edge of a pair of jeans? It's just so cool. And you realize how hard that would be to do in one step without the guide. Now let me show you how to do this one. It's the same way, it feeds the same way, and you put your ribbon in and stack it just like I did on the other one. As you can see, the larger ribbon goes on the bottom and it just graduates up. It's so beautiful. Okay, now I just bring all of my stacked ribbon over to my machine and just pop on the center stitch guide just like this. Very simple. Now I'm going to go ahead and start this with a zigzag stitch and then I'm going to place my project under here and there we go. <laughs> this is so cool. It's absolutely no hands. Check it out. Now let me show you some of the other projects that I've done.
that's just how easy it is to use the No Hands Ribbon Wizard.